All right, thanks for checking out my beet soup recipe. This is gonna serve for, total time is 45 minutes. Now, I'm sure you already know about the anti-inflammatory powers of beets, but did you know that ginger, which is also in this recipe, also helps fight inflammation? This savory and very tasty soup fights off inflammation, which many believe is at the root of disease. Is a pre it's a breeze to make, and it warms you up inside. It's a triple threat. Now, here are the ingredients. One tablespoon coconut oil, olive oil works too. Three cloves of garlic, smash them up. One large yellow onion diced. One tablespoon fresh ginger, finely chopped. Four cups plus one cup vegetable stock. Three large red beets, peeled and cubed in, qu in quarter inch pieces. Plus one teaspoon red beet, grated. One can of coconut milk, which is about 14 and a half ounces. A quarter teaspoon black pepper, freshly ground. And a half teaspoon of salt. And now for the directions. Number one, heat the oil up in a pot for the soup using medium heat. Two, go ahead and saute the onion for around about five minutes. Then add garlic and ginger. Keep cooking an additional five minutes. Step three, add cubed beets and four cups of stock. Then you raise the heat to create a boil. Once boiling occurs, reduce the heat and allow to simmer about 20 minutes or so. Beets should be soft when they're ready for the next step. Step four, now using a blender, puree the soup, or you can use an immersion blender using the remaining stock. If you prefer a thinner soup, and some do, Step five, mix in the coconut milk, salt, and pepper. Step six, finally, garnish with a quarter teaspoon of grated beet. Voila, there it is. Uh, you can always rewind, go back on this video, press pause to note the ingredients, press pause to note the directions. I've also put the ingredients and directions in the description of this video. Thanks so much for watching and enjoy this yummy dish. Make sure to come on back and to comment below about what you thought about it, as I'd love to get your feedback, and as always, I wish you the very best in your journey of and to better health.